morning guys I'm gonna take you along on a get ready with me today it's not gonna be anything special just plain straight hair and um, just a simple makeup look uh, I have volunteer work at the church tonight so it's not gonna be anything too extravagant I will do like a full glam um, video another time today is just not one of those days to for that to be accommodating so keep watching and I will see you in a bit. So let's start off with the shower. Here are all the products that I use in my shower. No, this is not Dove sponsored, but I do love Dove. I shampoo my scalp twice and condition my ends once. I also exfoliate my skin with this peach scrub every time I wash my hair, which is about twice a week. That bar soap is also an antibacterial soap for your face. Next, I brush my teeth and put in my contacts so I can see. Now it's time to blow dry my hair. This is all the products that I use for my hair. Again, this is not Dove sponsored. So I know I look like Cousin It, but I do like to blow dry the top layer of my hair in the opposite direction I want it to lay for a little bit more volume. Not everybody has to do this, but this is just how I do it. I do not like using a lot of heat on my hair, especially for everyday use, so I switched my blow dryer to cool and cool my hair down. Because I don't use a flat iron for everyday use, I do use an anti-frizz styling cream. It's makeup time! Of course, you always start with moisturizing your face. This is just the Equate brand of the Neutrogena Oil-Free Face Moisturizer. Next, I'm taking L'Oreal True Match in the shade W3 
and Wet n Wild Focus in the shade Soft Ivory. These two combined make the perfect shade of what I am right now. Next I take my NYX concealer in CW02 and start fixing those blemishes. Now for my translucent powder, I have the L'Oreal Hydra Perfect in shade Light. It's such a good powder. It kind of smells like old lady, but I guess it could smell worse. Mm, next is my favorite, my Butter Bronzer by Physicians Formula, and it smells like coconut, and it smells like summer. I love it. Also, I use what's left on my bronzer brush to base my eyelids with it. Now this is my NYX blush in Mocha. I've had this blush forever. It's so torn up, you can hardly see the label, but I love it. It's the perfect shade for my skin tone. Next is eyebrows, which I won't do on camera, but this is just the NYX eyebrow pencil in Taupe. This is the Maybelline Master Fix Plus. It just melts all of the products that I put on my face together and I love it. Now on to my Jaclyn Hill palette. This palette is a favorite of mine. It's pretty much the only thing that I use. Again, we are just volunteering at church with the kids this evening, so I'm not doing anything too crazy with my eyeshadow, just keeping it very natural. My Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette is also a favorite. Those two palettes combined make up 90% of my eye looks. also don't make this color anymore, but it's a great shade to highlight the eyebrow bone and the inner corner and the cupid's bone. Also didn't know how many Maybelline products that I used, but this is the Lash Sensational Mascara. with the 
and Maybelline Rockin' Volume Mascara. With everyday looks, I just use chapstick. I'm allergic to everything else, so I use Aquaphor. Trevor was playing hide and seek with our kid, so he hid in the shower. And that's what that was. And there you have it. That's the final look. I showed you in front of my window because my other lighting sucks. I hope you enjoyed this simple get ready with me. I will be doing more extravagant things, but today was just simple because we just have volunteer at church and that's about it. Thanks for watching.